All right, well, um, welcome back, everyone. We're going to pretend this is a new series, but it's really not. We're doing Draconian Air Elementalist. Ah, fuck. So the, the question that we have to ask ourselves is, like, what the hell are we going to do with Tengu now? Because, like, Tengu is, like, going to fuck us over, right? If we don't pick Air Elementalist. If we pick Tengu, we got to pick something that's decent. We could play it as a summoner. I mean, we sorry, we could play it as like a, a, a melee, but I don't think that's a good idea. Just because... Hmm. Sorry, I'm just trying to think about this. Hmm. Maybe swiftness is what we need. That seems stupid. To, to pay five mana to make my make my um flightless useless and also have a downside doesn't seem like a great idea. Wizard could be possible, but I want to kind of save that because Octopode is going to go for Wizard or Summoner. Uh, uh, God damn it! What was I going to play Draconian with? Probably air elementals. Okay, fair enough. Look, we'll just we'll forget about Tengu for now. We're gonna go air, draconian air elementals. One or two more. We'll see if that works. If it doesn't work, then we'll just go back to Tengu. I think it's probably the most reasonable idea. It's the reason why draconian I think is slightly more attuned towards um uh how do I say it? The reason why I think draconian is better than Tengu for uh, air elementals is they just have a little more health. Uh, we're gonna be running with I think like. 30% extra health differential because we have plus 10. They have minus 20% um, tango. So I'll have a lot more health, uh, which will help me tank a little bit more, which helps me set up double zaps a bit better. Um, and Draconian's never been a bad elementalist thing. Um, the main thing that, the main reason why I wanted to like kind of get away from Draconian Pastor is because um, like a lot of new players will tend to focus on color as like a huge factor of like, oh, I should not ever play Draconian X because if I play Draconian X, I get the wrong color and I have to restart. But the reality is, that's not the case at all. Um, Draconian does not really give a shit about color. Like, honestly, if you just never gave a shit about color, you'd probably be... Don't be racist. That's what that's what the moral of the story is. Just don't give a shit about your color. Because, like, you know, you can be successful even if you're of a different race. If you're not Aryan white, you can still be. You can still be different. You can still be white. Just because, just because you're not, you're not the right color. Like gray is a color too. You know what I mean? Like, and we shouldn't discriminate. But no, in in reality, like what? When, more seriously, um, yeah, like don't. The misconception is definitely there that draconian color is like the same as demons when we started. It's almost like that level of reroll, which is really stupid. Demon spawn rerolling is also really stupid. Um, but that's another. That's for another day, I guess. We haven't even. We haven't done demon spawn. Okay, I probably talked about it already. But basically, what I was saying, what I assume I was saying there was that uh, it'd be foolish for you to worry too much about uh, about demon spawn mutations either, because those aren't necessary at all. I'm actually gonna probably learn swiftness at some point on this character. Not really for anything, but as a token respect for having to actually run away from stuff. Though realistically, like, I don't know. I feel like I wouldn't have to run away on this character as much. I've already got more health than I had in Lair. Like, this is just stupid. Ah, uh, this is like the classic, do I want to go and die, or do I want to get this within the vault? Maybe I entered the vault last time from the side wrong. Let's just go ahead and watch this and see if it actually, like, will fuck me over. Okay. Gotta take the plunge. Okay, we're with the hidden now. Oh my god, that was that was risky as hell. I have no idea how that pattern works. Like, there's no way that like that I could guarantee easily that I would not get destroyed there. But whatever, I just did it. Because getting a D2 within the altar is pretty good. Alright, Zap's gonna be pretty decent here. Let's actually try to stay. Okay, 
But as you can see, look, I can actually hold my, my own in melee, which is pretty insane if you think about our, our, our Tengu, who could not literally sit in melee with anything. It was pretty embarrassing. But at least now I can like, kind of melee stuff. I don't have to be too worried about like even one turn in melee would kill me. Like It's a much more forgiving combo. And I think that actually might be the right choice. Um, probably in my next greater player run, I will be doing slightly more. Uh, I might make a little bit of time to just kind of give a nod out to the uh, Draconian start of the mage, because it's not bad by any stretch of the imagination. The, mo the main reason, oops, I, I kind of messed that up with the wording, but the main reason why I didn't want to do Draconian was again the. Uh... God damn it. Alright, let's just go up in. We, we obviously have removed curse in our inventory somewhere, right? Like, you're not going to have 20 something scrolls and not have removed curse, that's just messed up. Um, but yeah, uh, I might do a little bit of a, like, a nod to that in the next series where I, I'll go Draconian Mage first as the first major one. Though, in that particular run, I'm not going to be doing, uh, in the greater player run that pr that follows this one, I'm definitely not going to give a shit about, like, oh, what are the players going to want, uh, what are the viewers going to want to watch in terms of, like, in terms of like um like new combos, I mean, I'm, I'm going to be doing it. It's going to be a much more personalized run, I guess, if that makes sense. Like, it's not supposed to be as emulative, emulatable, because there'll be combos in there that I just do because I can do it, and it's easy as shit for me to do. But it won't be easy for a lot of other people to do. So that's like my own style of greater player. Right now, I'm trying to do it like in a way that kind of is replicatable in some way. So that's probably. I was hoping that Tengu Air Element Plus was viable, but given that I've died so many times, I don't, I don't think it is. Though I might just be wrong. Scarf there. I need to run away rather than fight this stuff. Okay, this is slightly more doable. Like, look at that. We actually had a skeleton, something in melee with us, and we didn't die instantly. We legitimately have more health than we did in Lair, uh, for our other character, I think. I'm gonna pull around the corner just to get that centaur from being so goddamn annoying to us. Alright, we've got ice magic. Uh, that's not a big deal. Um, white draconian is fine. Um, air, the gust, the, the cold breath is pretty strong this early in the game. It does a lot of damage. Cold resistance is probably not necessary, so the scarf is not active. Um, but it basically does mean that this is now our primary, like, opening attack move, basically. Um, whenever we want to hit something, we just hit it with Ice Breath. And so long as we actually get it, we should do decent damage. I, I think that Ice Breath is, like, the weakest of the breaths, honestly, but that's just me. Ugh, this is kind of bad as well. We can like semi ice breath kite with this character uh, with Draconian as well in the same way that Naga kind of can but Naga's slow so it doesn't work this one actually kind of does work which is good um you kind of like just smack stuff with your ice breath and they can't do much about it obviously this character will uh this character will progress a lot slower in terms of like learning stuff but that's fine plus ring of protection is really good for us like, this is a really decent start. Uh, let's hope that we don't get killed by this asshole. Okay, looks like we're gonna get killed by this asshole. Let's teleport here. Okay, yeah, it didn't look like we were doing any damage to that guy, so that's pretty bad. There he is. Um, airstrike. Airstrike. Pull away, airstrike. Ice bolt. Nice. Managed to kill him without having to do much. Bring a flight. Whatever, we'll just keep it in our inventory, but we don't need it. Bring a wizardry. That's pretty good. Bring a slaying. That's pretty bad. Wizardry is pretty good right now. Probably better for the dodge. Um, so yeah, we can get lightning bolt up early, which is good. That means our airstrike fails less, which is also nice. Like the the, the oh shit, this is pretty bad. 
stack shocks here. Uh, double zap. Ah, this is really bad. Back ref. Nope. Alright, that was just a really unfortunate set of attacks there that like drained us pretty bad. But we managed to get away from it. That's good. Ice breath again takes out everything in bolt. It's basically like a free bolt of cold, which is nice. For selling the game. Um, it, it does miss a lot though, I notice. Like that's why I don't like it as much. Uh wait for these guys to get in the line. Yeah, that didn't work as well as I wanted to, that's fine. Ah, this is pretty bad. Hoping to kill Duvessa first. But it's. Okay, well, we can just one shot it. We're gonna airstrike uh, Doan, because he's gonna be dodging and doing all the dumb shit, just kill him. He's like doing all these acrobatics and stuff, and just kind of smack him down. He's not paying attention. Alright, Bailey is not really that doable for us, but whatever. If we get it, we'll see. We'll see if we can do it. Again, there is a possibility that we can actually do this kind of stuff, but it's not likely. So this is a pretty bad vault for us, I think. But we will take out a couple of them, just to get some XP. Like, there's a warlord at the end of this. There's no way we can fight that. That's too many guys. But we can easily take some free XP, I think. Stack discharge, pretty good here. That's the Orc Warrior. Uh, we can get like some good ish hits on him using just avoid this altogether. That's not bad. Okay. Alright, so Behemoth's just being a troll now. He's just like, lol, you can have fire stuff. You're a fire mage, right? Even though we are an ice mage, technically. Maybe he's just maybe he's just telling us to diversify, but as you can see, we get a plus two to ice magic, minus two to fire magic. It's not a big deal, but. Okay, I was just checking if there was distortion there. Sometimes it. You never know if it spawns with distortion. Alright. Alright. We cleared this two, these two areas. This is going to be a slightly tougher room, and the last room will be very tough. Uh, should open with Hulk. Uh, with the ice breath. The reason why we want to open with ice breath is because it'll give it more time to recharge. Uh, in between fights, giving us a better chance of getting hit twice. As you can see, it misses a lot. Like, I missed both times I cast there. That's why, like I said, I don't, I don't particularly like. Yeah, there's the wall. Well, I need to leave. I mean, yes, we could have ninja around, but I think that it would have been too much risk for that reward. Like, I would have used my blink 100% pretty much, and. I don't know if I want to lose that protection uh, for that buffering, I guess, from the that I can get from the blinking. Uh, yeah, airstrike takes the better out. Probably could have also ice breath, but I forgot. Yeah, so that's just like annoying when you just see that. Like, ice breath miss, ice breath miss. Like, when is it ever going to hit? That's why I always say it's like the worst one. Casually do three bows in the house in one shot. I don't know. I mean, that was a pretty overpowered. No, it wasn't really. I just don't know what that was. If I can just get like one good set of shots on him, he'll die, but it looks like that's not going to happen this time around. Ah, oh, this is frustrating. We did kind of spam the other game. Ah, shit. Let's use swiftness here. Um, just to create the distance and also to give us a good chance of escaping. Ice Beast. Just go ahead and ice strike that. Pull this guy off. We're going to just use a bit of ice breath. Kiting a little bit. 
I get missed a lot. That sucks. But whatever. I'll do much about that. Oh, God. Just shot right here, like on the very edge of my shot. Just so I draw a couple of guys and not like a lot. I should have just done this from the beginning, honestly. This is gonna hurt. Um, good agility. You can just like do a little bit more damage to the vehicle. There we go. Got him. This is a very bad position for us, but thankfully we have resistance and agility. Up. It's not too bad. Okay. Pretty unfortunate, but that's alright. Like, I have no excuse to not win this game. Because I've already, like, fucked up so many tangies, and then I play this character. Like, I should win. I, I'll win a Draconian Air Olympus in, like, two games in once, I think. Two, maybe three. I don't think it's as hard as Tengu. But you can really see the difference in like between Tengu and oh shit, this is bad. Um, teleport here. The reason why I teleport there is because I know that the thing is gonna go berserk. Once it goes berserk, I can't stop him. Get swiftness up. Just lightning bolts. Throw one like just casual ice breath that. Green Bay. If it kills it, it kills it. That'd be nice. But obviously, we're not counting on killing it. <sighs> Step one again. Like, obviously, this is like significantly easier than the Tangu. That doesn't mean it's easy exactly, but it just means that it's like, by comparison, it's easy. But it does mean that we still have to like kite and do all this like optimal ish stuff. Tedious stuff, however you want to say it. Let's go down one more. Yeah. Oh, that's a hill of fire. I think I can take that. We'll, we'll have to go down a different staircase though. Wait, does that only mean 12 minutes? No, 17. Okay, I was going to say that. 12 minutes does not sound like a lot of time. Do we already die with this guy? I forgot. Full mind. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, lightning bolt at one percent. Can we take this off now? Yes, we can. Sick, because that gives us three free AC for nothing. Like it doesn't cost us anything. Uh, we'll focus the conjurations. Turn the air magic off for now. Train dodger. I think at one percent fail. I don't give a shit about lightning bolts. Like spell power as much. We're gonna be switching out of this ASAP pretty much. Oh my god, fuck! I messed that up so bad. Actually, so embarrassed for myself. Okay, Ooh, that was pretty close. Oh, we got Lightning Spire. That's really good. Uh, that means dodging can take a turn off for a sec. Since we need to uh, get Lightning Spire a little bit more comfortable. That's, like, pretty good. I can airstrike and Lightning Spire. And, like, Lightning Bolt and everything. It's pretty good. Okay. You wondered why that little thing got knocked, uh, why the Queen Bee got knocked out for a sec, or knocked backwards. It's because the Ice Breath. It buffets, um, flying enemies. This is pretty bad. Uh, let's just walk away for a bit. Get ourselves a bit of distance with a free Lightning Spire. Okay, just decided we didn't give a shit about that at all. Okay, this thing is just an asshole. Like he's killing us. He's killing the lightning spire in like one turn, and then he's just not giving a shit at all that we do it. I wonder if we die here. Possibly. Hmm. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cast swiftness out here. That's gonna let us get away from both these enemies, I guess. Pull back. Okay, now we're here. 
we can actually kind of fight this thing a little bit better. There we go. Like, that, that's how the fight was supposed to be from day one, but it just decided to, like, it basically, like, hit me, random energy, hit me, random energy, hit me, random energy. Oh, like, it hit the stat, uh, the lightning spot, sorry, and then random energy me. Like, so it just caught up and hit me at the same turn. So basically, it just killed the spire, and basically, the spire was, like, complete waste of mana, because it didn't do anything at all. It didn't slow it down, which is what I wanted it to do, but it just random energy back into melee range, like, three or four times. It was really frustrating, but I was just, like, not in the right mind to explain it, I guess. Really? And then you just died at airstrike? That's embarrassing, dude. Purple Red's Ghost shouldn't be that strong. Purple Red is a known speedrunner. His ghosts are therefore weaker on average. Okay, we're getting hit by dispersals or something. I'm just gonna back off near our flying spot to let it take care of everything. Okay, I know there's bees around, so I'm just gonna get the spire up early. Get the buffer up. Throw Icicle, that's a good spell. Especially for a character like us. Uh, let's put Lion Spire here, so we can block us up. Nice. Throw Icicle, we're gonna be on Static Discharge mode. Um, I guess we'll abuse the fact that we have it like, we have a plus two to it, so we'll just add a bit more into Ice Magic. Oh, we just threw out the phone, right up. That's good. Uh, let me just go get that back one sec. I just kind of like threw it on the ground in anger, apparently. In disgust. Holy shit, I just realized my mic is down here. Have I been recording at all? Oh my god, I fucking hate this. Holy shit, I'm so triggered. Have I been, have I been just, oh my god, my mic hasn't been clipped on. This is the this is the danger of fuck. I'm so mad. Sorry guys. I'm oh man. I'm really absent-minded today. We fucked it, dude. Did I really just? Oh my god. Was I not recording at all then? Like I basically just wasn't recording. Holy shit. I'm so oh. Hmm. That's good. Yeah. Alright, well, that's. That happened, I guess. So, you've been watching this video probably with no audio. That's fun. So, just skip to. How long is this? What, what, what? Skip to 2222 for actual audio, because fuck. I mean, I could do post commentary, but I don't think it's necessary. Like, pretty much speaks for itself. This is like the worst day of my life for recording. Holy shit. I've never had a recording day this bad before. Like, legit. It's pretty sad. Like, the one time I get an actually, like, good-ish run, I, like, fuck it up by not recording it properly. Ah, uh, sometimes I wish I didn't have this lab mic. Seriously, like, fuck. Okay, did we kill that thing? Okay. Well, actually, wait. Did I drop it when I was... Fuck, I need to go watch it back. Like, I'm gonna be really pissed off if I fucked it up and the audio is really bad. But it could have been that I just, like, knocked it off my phone and then... Oh, god damn. I don't even know, guys. Fuck my life. Ah, oh, we're on D11. Oops. We don't want to be here anymore. D11, too scary. Oh, this is fun. Well, at least we got the, like, kind of good stuff here. I think we can turn summonings off for now. We'll train some dodging. We'll go full defense for now. Fulminant Prison. Eh, it's an alright spell. Don't really want it though. Book of Ice. Holy shit, okay. That's good. That's Freezing Cloud. Um, that's Freezing Cloud and Ozakubo's Refrigeration slash Metabolic and Glaciation. That's, and Bolt of Cold. Holy shit, that's a good, that's a really good book for us right now. Alright, that was fun. Let's go Invis here. Just smack him down. We wasted the Invis, but whatever. It was worth it. Just because of the frustration that was happening there. Uh, 
Uh, let's lightning bolt here. Just can't fight this thing. Oh my god, I'm actually like, I just want to end the video now. Because like, I don't want, I want to see if I actually like fucked it up. Please don't kill me, dude. Like, are you fucking kidding me? Okay, lightning spire here. Make it really efficient for us. Though the lightning spider doesn't shoot at max efficiency, that's fine, I think. Okay, Jesus. Gonna back off here, close the door. Okay, have that teleport. Have that have that guy teleport rather than me. Because I know that my surroundings are safer than wherever he's gonna go. Uh, stand like this, I guess. Shoot through my own guy. More int is good, I guess. Just spam icicles on that thing. Okay. Come on. That was good. Okay. Decent amount of lightning bolt. This is like some weird double zap trick shots. Oh god. Like I yeah, I just want to end the video because I don't I want to see if I actually recorded that properly. I'm being pretty mad if I don't. And then this whole video is kind of wasted if I do. Ah, uh, it's a lose lose situation right now. Like I'm in I'm in a bad I'm in a bad way right now. In a bad place. Just gotta remember there's gonna be good times coming up. Purple red. Go Sophia. What is this? Troll Gladiator. Shouldn't be doing this. You shouldn't be healing this much. Jesus. I don't have enough damage to kill this thing. It's just regening like crazy. Just pull back. Finish all the nice goals. Like, this should not be that difficult. But somehow it is. Oh my god, thank god for lightning spire. Holy shit. Okay, lightning bolts. Ow. That's all I can say. As you can see, like, this is so forgiving comparative to, <laughs> uh, this is like ridiculously com uh, forgiving. Like, this is actually so sad how forgiving this is. I feel like I'm being babied right now, just because like of how easy this is comparative to Tengu. Like, I should have died like five times over with Tengu by now, but because like I've just been given so many free chances because of this much health and ridiculous garbage like that. Like, because of my health pool, I can just kind of like avoid. I can afford to like take damage. It's insane. Like, what a what a foreign concept to me right now. Okay, let's get the fear scroll and then go in. Ah, this could be a bad place for me to go in, especially given how dense it is with like ridiculously annoying enemies right now, like redbacks and hungry ghosts and gargoyles. Like, there's a lot of stuff in this maze hall labyrinth now. It's kind of annoying. I liked it back a lot more back when it was just nothing. Just the labyrinth, the minotaur in itself. It's a challenge. And now it's just tedium. I guess it was more tedious before. No wands. Feels good now. Alright. We're playing with fire now. That's not the right saying. I don't know why I keep saying that. We're cooking with fire? We're cooking with the gas? What are we doing? Cooking with other mitts. Who knows? Let's see if it wraps around to the left. Uh, if you weren't aware, this is like my defeated voice. I just want to get this game done so I can 
go back to Melee. I might play a couple of refresher games to um, return me back to like a reasonable level of skill. This is this doesn't feel like enough. It feels like the distance between each win is like so low. I, I guess maybe I should just wait for Uni to come back. Because once Uni hits, I'll probably be playing a bit more. I'm um, in my own time. Just to like, I'll make a new account and I'll just play it myself. Um, like off recording. Because obviously you can't record at Uni. Um, oh, you can, but like it's not going to be worthwhile. And I'm going to be playing on a different computer and everything. It's just like not worth it. I am a. Alright, we're in the Blackstone. That's probably where the Minotaur is at some point. There he is. Let's hit him with like as much shit as we can right now. Fuck. Why is he so fast? What? Okay, hit him with that. Okay, we got him from the outside of the screen. That was good. He didn't do too much damage to us. Uh, this is a good selection of wands, crystal stuff. Crystal fashion, I'll consider. Of course, it's distortion, but that's actually a good distortion, so I don't care too much. Okay, pull away. Alright, it's fine. Like this distortion, you might be like, oh shit, that's really bad for him, but it's R plus, RC plus, plus A. It's not bad. It actually, like, functions, kind of. Man, this thing does not realize that I don't care at all about my fucking lightning spire. Yes, shoot it with cold. I don't care. It doesn't affect me. This guy is, like, unreasonably close to me right now. Not a fan. I could teleport if I was feeling really queasy about this, but I'm actually feeling okay about this Hydra being here. Just creating distance by making it shoot, uh, attack the Lightning Spire as we go along. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Alright. Cool. I guess. Not really a fan of the Freezing Cloud uh, anymore. I used to be okay with it, but I find it's too tedious to use nowadays, but we'll use it. Good spell. I just don't like it as much, because the, the targeting is, for some reason it became really stupid at some point. Like, I don't know why, but it just is really shit at like targeting nowadays. But, as you can see, it's kind of effective. Oh, it's very effective, sorry, against dealing with lair enemies. It's very high damage. It's pretty good. I can't really deny its effectiveness. Like, look at that. Pretty damn good if you ask me. Alright, nice. Like, this is pretty good, I guess. Bam. Look at that. They just all die, they can't do anything. But I guess, like, like the problem is, like, most spells can also do that to the axe as well. Most AoE spells of that level. Like, any level 6 spell will do the same thing to the axe. And these... this The difference is this spell particularly is, like, Three classes, three schools. Wow, this is a nice ring. A nice amulet. It's literally just a straight upgrade over Alan. Cool, I guess. I should probably amnesia stuff. Um, I want to get the, uh, what do you call it? Bolt of Cold up ASAP. It's a really good spell. This character. 33 minutes. Alright. See, like, against enemies that just run outside, Freezing Cloud is not amazing, but against enemies like this, this is pretty good. I can just kite them, kind of, eternally, and it does a lot of damage, too. Okay, let's just hope that we can just kill these guys before they get to us. Uh, can we do a good bolt spell? Nice. Perfect. Great way of dealing. Like, that was a really good uh, handling of that Death Yak pack. Okay. Looks like the ice magic is starting to, try to pay off big time. Um, dodging is pretty good. I think we'll turn dodging off for a bit to get some more conjurations at some point. Most likely. 
Yeah, we'll turn it off now. We'll get some more conversations. Nine is not that much. We can afford to do a little bit more, I think. Going to use a lightning spire here. Okay, not bad. At some point, we want to also pick up shields. Our buckler in our inventory wants to be trained, but that time might not be right now. Might be training. We might need a couple more things first. Okay, just kind of hiding behind the lightning spire there. Double shafted. Okay, that warrants. Um... Okay, we got put right into the center of a clusterfuck here. I'm gonna try to use quiet spells rather than loud ones. Fuck, yeah, we got screwed. Like, we got straight up RNG'd here. We got, like, put right in the worst position possible. Scroll of Acquirement, okay. Um. Armor is probably the most effective one, I think. Weapons not that good, stuff's not that good. Stuff is decent, but I think at this stage, because we have this uh, distortion weapon we don't want to take off just yet, armor's probably better. Okay, plus two hat. Plus two AC is pretty decent. I'll take it. It's freezing cloud, that dream sheep. The dream sheep are really frustrating to play with. Like, I know we kind of didn't really mention it, like, like I said from the beginning they were going to be really frustrating, but like the one they're most frustrating towards for at least is like this particular type of character, which is like squishy, easy to kill. Those guys like really hate that. Hold the cold. We can actually unmemorize lightning bolts now, I think. Probably. Yeah. And that'll let us pick up Blink. Well, we we might learn uh, Bolt back, Lightning Bolt back later, but it's right now I prefer to have this particular spell. I think it's a bit better. Um, let's turn spell casting off for just a sec. We'll put translocations on just to get the uh, Blink down from twelve percent. Probably falling like one fourth. Bolt of Cold is an inferior version to Bolt of Fire. It's got less range. Um, and I just, I don't know, I vaguely find it to be not as effective. Like, the, the reason may have blurred in time, but I feel, I think it's because of less range. I'm not exact, I don't really know. Scroll summon, okay. Um, let's just drop some useless crap then, I guess. God damn it, okay. We are our poise. That's that's one like blessing that we have. We're really our poise. With both the amulet and the uh, weapon giving us our poise. Okay, let's just pray that this works. Didn't work. Okay. Oh god. Alright, so if we can get six mana we can do some good stuff. There we go. Two kills. Pretty good. Now the lightning spire is just gonna take care of stuff. Oh, never mind. Timed out. Well, mild staff. I don't really know what I would give up uh, this weapon for right now. Risking abyss as well. Probably like I don't know. It would have to be like an energy staff or a cold staff. But I don't even think it's that necessary, so I probably won't bother. All right, blink down to four percent. Fuck it. Fuck blink then. We'll just train spell casting again. Focusing on conjurations for a sec. See, like, we have 108 health. Like, that's so, like, foreign to me as the Tengu. Like, that's what I mean. Like, Tengu has such little health, it's so frustrating to play. It's like Deep Elf, but not as good as Deep Elf, because Deep Elf at least has, like, amazing spellcasting aptitudes and all that shit. So we get tons of mana. This one gets, like, no mana and no conjurations. Oh, sorry, like, no mana and no health. So it's like, what the fuck is the point of that character? It's squishy in every respect. It's frustrating. Actually, energy is not even necessary. I just realized because I already have a uh, what do you call it? I already have Gormand. So it's not even that good. Damn. So I guess there's really no stuff I care about that much that I would take this weapon off. I mean, this weapon's not bad at all. Like that's what you have to realize. Distortion doesn't really make a difference. It's 
even if it wasn't distortion, it'd still be a weapon I'd be holding onto like 90% of the time anyway. Distortion simply means that the other 10% of the time I just don't get a choice. Which is not, again, not a big deal. Okay, we should probably be using our ice breath a little bit more, but like I said, I don't like using it because it's so bad. It's so unwieldy compared to the other ones. I don't know why the ice cloud aims like that. It's so stupid. Like, that's the auto aim. I assumed it would just automatically hit the right target, but it doesn't. God, it's so frustrating. <laughs> Get ourselves a lightning spy here. Okay, not bad. It's probably better for me to just put the lightning spy down rather than worry about the freezing cloud. I'm pretty sure the polar bear is like cold resistant or some shit like that. Get an ally with us. Probably shouldn't be screwing around so much with those berserk enemies. So again, this character feels like invulnerable basically because of how much health he has. It's so sad. Like a hundred's not even that much. It's just like a decent amount. But like because I've been just running on like fifties to sixties the whole time, even with like more fighting than this, like just has not felt like a real character in a long time. Ah, Tengu. Worst class, best combo. Let's just try to finish this last six. Uh, this is kind of bad. I have no mana, I need to leave. Shouldn't have been playing with that low mana, but whatever. He did it. Probably also shouldn't be meleeing so much, given that our distortion weapon is just going to be annoying. But it's just so nice to melee, you know what I mean? Like, it's nice to be able to melee, as weird as that sounds. It feels like it can actually do damage. Oh, this is kind of... Whoa, holy shit. Guys, guys. There's only one of me, alright? Settle down. Oh, fuck. I actually need to airstrike that thing. Because like before I can take care of these elephants, I need to make sure that I'm okay and I'm not going to get frozen to death. Okay. If I can get a good, like, cold bolt here. Yeah, I'll get some mana back. I didn't get enough back. Okay. I don't know why I just accidentally airstrike there. That was dumb. Having Z D and Z F be so close to each other is like pretty risky, I guess. Catablopus probably don't want to be anywhere near this place anymore. Alright, this is like not I, I wanna just kinda of stand here so that my line fire takes care of a couple of those enemies. Oh fuck, that was scary. Alright, pull upstairs, I guess. Alright, I feel like my judgment is lapsing with this character already, so I'm gonna take a break. I'll probably come back in an hour or so, and I'll record again. Um, I wanna get to a decent area ish with this character before I, uh, stop for the day. Which does mean that I will be like, we're, we're about like, gonna be a week in advance, I guess, which is fine. Um, the surplus will be good. Alright, let's end it here, I guess. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll see you all. Oh, that's a cold stuff. That's good for in the future. But for now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all tomorrow.